It is a busy news night, so heading into the weekend, we want to give you a reason to smile with a story uplifting Arizona. Yeah, tonight, meet a Valley Whiz kid putting artificial intelligence and drones to work. Cameron Pullum shares her story. It works, and then it sometimes doesn't work. Innovative solutions to problems plaguing our world sometimes come from unexpected places. In 2020 alone, there were around 58,250 wildfires and more than 10.3 million acres burned in the U.S. So this is a wildfire map. Precia Schroff, just 14 years old, setting her sights on preventing the devastating and many times heartbreaking impacts of wildfires, tackling this big problem using a rather sophisticated plan of attack. Basically what it does is it detects hotspots, which are areas where wildfires can start. And I designed the wildfire prevention system. The system she's designed uses real-time NASA and NOAA meteorological data and predicts if an area's conditions are ripe for disaster, combining artificial intelligence to analyze temperatures in the area, soil moisture, vegetation health, wind, and precipitation. Using previous year's data, I tested it to see can it predict where the wildfires occurred, and then did they actually happen there? And so I got a 98.6% accuracy. Once a location is identified, the system alerts fire agencies and can even launch a fixed-wing drone to dump flame retardant. The impressive results not only getting her recognition from Chandler Fire now interested in implementing her system, but earning her way to the Broadcom Masters National Science Competition Top 30. I'm looking into um, getting a patent for the idea, and then I'm also looking into working with the ASU lab to create the drone deployment system. She's always been um, this motivated kid who wants to go change the world. Her family says it's been an inspiration to watch her mind work. I have like no idea how she even got to where she did when the coding part of her project. But it hasn't come without its doubters. Seeking advice oh, from okay. teachers prior to starting the project, Prisha got a surprising response. Some of them said it's too hard, you can't do it. And she came back home and said, Mom, they said this, but I'm going to still work on it. And maybe because they told her she couldn't, she did. Now in the running for a $25,000 prize. Author Simon Sinek may have put it best. What good is an idea if it remains an idea? Try, experiment, fail, try again, change the world. I'm Cameron Polum, ABC 15, Arizona. I wish you could hear Amber cheering from the Weather Center the whole time that story you was You go, running. girl! We echo that sentiment. <laughs> what an awesome student. Yeah. So cool. 14, yeah. by the way. Yeah. Just so yeah, cool. Think about that.